Hello friends, welcome to my YouTube channel. I am back with 10 Excel tricks that will make you advance in Excel. So before I start this video, if you didn't subscribe my channel, please do subscribe my channel and press the bell icon so that you can get notification of my new videos. So let's get started. Our first trick is how to add images to chart. Here we have data of apps and ratings and I have already made one chart that is bar chart. If you want to add image to chart, you just click on this image and copy this image and select the bar, one bar and paste it here. Again, I select this, copy this and select this bar and paste it here. Again, I am copying this and select this bar and paste it here. And now if you change your ratings like I am giving rating to Facebook 4.98 it will change your chart with images. So let's move to our next trick that is how to use pivot table timeline. We have one data that is stocks and trade volumes. I have already created here pivot table. Now I'm going to create pivot table timeline. For this, you have to go to pivot table analyze and insert here timeline. Select the date and click on OK. Now you go to this timeline. Here you can select years, quarters or even days you want to select. Now I am selecting month. If I select two months or three months data or four months data, it will show me data of four months only. So that is how you can use pivot table timeline. It will be very helpful for you. If you want quarterly data, you can also select this. It will give you quarter data. Now let's move to our next trick that is two ways to remove extra spaces. For this, we can use one formula that is trim function. That is TRIM bracket start. Select your cell and bracket close. It will remove extra spaces from your data. Drag this. And second formula for this is substitute formula. Substitute. Now select your text. Then comma double q toes space double q toes then comma then double q toes then double q toes and bracket close. Enter. It will also remove extra spaces from your data. Now let's move to our next trick that is how to create data entry form in Excel. For this you have to go to your file tab and go to options. Go to customize ribbon, select all commands, search for form. Can simply press F and search for form here and here you get the form you can insert it in into any tab I'm inserting it into home tab creating new group here and add this form click on OK now in home tab we have form here for this you have to select one range that is your headings click on form click on ok now it will create data entry form for you now i'm giving here one data like that name is vishal other name is shushi agarwal class here MBA phone number is 
now click on new now next entry second name here Roit father name is Rish Kumar class is 12th phone number is I am writing here phone number and click on new this is how you can create data entry form in Excel now let's move to our next shortcuts that is six shortcuts I'm giving you six six smart shortcuts that will make you advance in Excel that is our first shortcut is auto sum how to auto sum what is the shortcut for auto sum is alt is equal to we have some data here now I am pressing alt is equal to it will auto sum your data second one is how to get current date for this you have to press control semicolon 26 August 2023 now next shortcut is how to freeze first row with a shortcut you can press alt w f r and here you go your first row will freeze let's move to our next shortcut that is how to freeze first column for this you can press alt w f c now you can see here our first column is freezed now let's move to our next shortcut that is line chart how to make line chart with a shortcut for this you can press alt and s l and select your data range that is i am selecting here click on location range that is this range click on ok this is how you can create line charts if I change this data it will convert 4.9 to 4.5 now let's move to our next shortcut that is how to input emojis in Excel for this you can press window plus semicolon here we go we got the emojis so from this shortcut you can add any emoji from this emojis bar so thank you so much for watching this video if you like this video please do subscribe my channel and press the bell icon and if you have any query regarding excel please do comment on comment section and please do share to your friends so that they can also learn advanced excel